Hi! Today I'm going to be talking about sustainable clothing and, in particular, sustainable brands for bras and underwear. I've done some videos in the past talking about sustainable clothing brands, what I own, what I like. I've talked about thrifting plenty in the past, but I think this is an area where I wouldn't recommend thrifting. I don't even think thrift stores take, like, intimates, anything that falls in that category, just because, I mean, it, it's obvious why they don't. I do think that there might be one exception to this thrifting rule, and that would be for maybe like a bralette. I think I'd probably feel comfortable thrifting that, even if someone had worn it before a few times. That doesn't like gross me out or anything, but for the most part, this is kind of an area where you want to find some sustainable clothing brands that use good fabrics, ethical treatment of workers, other things like that, so I have some brands to recommend. The first one is Parade. I have some underwear from Parade, and I did want to call out right away. I really like these, and I would buy from them again in the future. The prices are good. The underwear is like maybe like $9 a piece, although they have that thing where you like build a box, you could like buy five pairs and it discounts the price overall. And their bras are like less than $30 as well. But the material that they use is not cotton, and I know a lot of people are more particular about wanting their underwear to be made out of cotton. This is made out of recycled nylon, in my opinion, they're very comfortable. They have a lot of really great stretch to them. Like, they just fit really well. I feel like most underwear is like, yeah, it just, it fits fine. It's my size, but it just, they, it has this mesh piece as well that is like really stretchy and nice. I will say the one negative that I have about Parade, and this is just particularly exclusive to me, and that's their color selection. They have a lot of bright colors. It's kind of like their thing. They have a huge color selection, some patterns, and I am just a person who does not like really colorful bras or underwear. Plain colors is what I go for. I still was able to like get some, like I have this dark bluish purple and I have a black and I think I have a lighter blue as well. But if you're really strictly looking for neutrals, Parade isn't the strongest in that aspect, but I still would recommend the brand overall. They definitely care about sustainability and size inclusivity as well. The next brand I wanted to talk about, I have mentioned before because when I purchased from this brand, We Are Ha, H-A-H, -H, I got a mystery box and they sent me swimsuits, some clothing pieces, and some bras and underwear. They like have clothing and swimsuits, but I would say they specialize in lingerie and I just love the pieces that they picked for me since it was a mystery box, but I've spent plenty of time on their website as well. It's a little bit more expensive compared to a brand like Parade, like the underwear is more like $20, but they have so many sales, so many, and like things are just constantly going on sale. And also it's a little bit higher end. It's not just like a standard regular old underwear. It's more interesting than that. And like the bralette I have is like, this black with lace and in the back it's like a racer back and it has these adjustable um bands around the side it's just so comfortable and so cute as well i just really love this brand even though it's a little bit pricier if you're looking for nicer lingerie that is eco-friendly i would highly recommend kind of on the other end of the spectrum i have a brand that is very basic. Like this brand makes plain white t-shirts, they make plain black leggings, and they make really simple bras and underwear, and that's packed. I think I bought like 
They have packs. I think I got like three of these and they are very affordable. They're really standard. So I didn't expect them to be like crazy amazing, like blown away by the comfort or style or anything. But if you're just looking for the basics, Wear Packed is a really great website to check out. The prices on Packed are pretty similar to the prices at Parade as well. And they have a similar like six pack type of deal with the underwear. And it's nothing like crazy amazing, but it's just like a really good go-to. Like if you're not looking to find any crazy colors or any really interesting styles, you just want standard bras and underwear, then Pact I think would be a good pick. I have a couple more brands that I wanted to mention that I have not purchased from yet. The first three I have, obviously I showed what I, a couple of things that I have from those, but there are some other brands that I haven't bought from just because I haven't had the need, but if I do in the future, I would be interested in checking these brands out. And one of them is Hara the label. I get this brand advertised to me on Instagram pretty frequently and I've checked it out a couple of times. I just really like their style. I believe their fabric is made from bamboo, which obviously is a very sustainable material. Great choice. They also have plenty on their website about what they're doing from an ethical workplace perspective. They have a pretty good selection, I would say, of different types of bras. Not like underwire real bras, but like sports bras, bralettes, bra tops, kind of and different cuts of underwear, as well as some loungewear. I think they have like sweatpants as well. The prices here are a little bit higher. Again, a little bit more comparable to We Are Ha. I think it's like $30 for a piece rather than 12, so it's a little bit more. But the fabric looks really nice. It would be a great brand to support. I think they have quite a few color options, neutrals and brighter colors. Definitely very size inclusive as well. I think they go up to like 4XL, so pretty wide range there for if you're looking for that. Another bamboo fabric intimates brand is Booty Body with two O's. <laughs> um, they make bras and underwear and I think some loungewear as well. Just like the overall vibe is a little bit more simple but the prices at booty are again back on the lower range like more similar to packed i think it's like 12 dollars for a pair of underwear again so back on the more affordable range booty has a bunch of great certifications from an environmental perspective an ethics perspective they're PETA approved not that i think there's much non-vegan underwear out there considering i don't know why anyone would want underwear type clothing made out of wool or silk, I guess that would probably be more common. So no wool or silk or anything like that. I definitely think I'm going to be purchasing from the brand booty in the future just cause it looks really good to me. It's affordable. So I would like to try that out the next time. I think I need to buy any of these types of items. I wanted to talk about one bra brand in particular since a lot of the brands I've mentioned already have bras, but not like real bras, like the kind with an adjustable strap and a hook in the back and underwire. A lot of the ones I've mentioned are more like sports bras and bralettes, which is totally fine. But if you're looking for a real bra brand and you have small boobs, <laughs> wear Pepper. I think it's just called Pepper. They make bras specifically for a to B cup and they just look so nice and they talk about how environmentally friendly they are. I'm just a fan of the whole website. It just looks like a really good brand. I definitely would like to purchase my next bra from here. I wish they made a strapless bra though. I don't think they do unfortunately because that would be the one thing I'm kind of in need of but I just really like that they built it specifically for women with smaller chests and I appreciate that as a woman in that category. 
And I know that this isn't the most inclusive, obviously. It's uh, the sizes are restricted, like they don't sell like D cup bras on the website, but I just want to mention it anyway because if you're in the market for it, I think this looks like a good brand. And as far as pricing, these bras are like $40 to $50, which in my opinion is pretty standard price for a bra. So I think the price point is good. Not crazy expensive, not super cheap either. And then the very last website I wanted to mention is called Azura Bay. And this is like a marketplace, an online marketplace. They carry a ton of different brands that are sustainable lingerie and I think they have swimsuits too and loungewear and they make it a point to only carry eco-conscious brands. I really like this website just because it has a really big variety. Being a marketplace you definitely are guaranteed to find something you like. The only drawback I would say of Azure Bay is that the prices skew kind of high. Like they have some brands from some really fancy eco-friendly brands that is like 70, 80, 90 dollars which is just like way out of my price range. They look great but I don't think that's as accessible of a price point for most people but it still would be good to look around and see all of the different brands they have and maybe if you find a more affordable one you could either buy it through this marketplace or explore that brand's website directly. So those are all of the different sustainable bra and underwear companies that I wanted to mention today. Hopefully this video was helpful for you if you're in the market for any pieces like this. I'll link all of the websites below so you can check them out and thanks for watching.